Hello, I'm back. So I am Vic of EUS Market Biz, and for today I'm going to show you a very high potential token. So without further ado, let's proceed to the token itself. Right. So the name of the token is DabCoin. So this is the token brought to you by the Dab Network. So currently it's ranked 754 in coin market cap. So this is its current price. The market cap of DabCoin is one million nine hundred seventy-seven thousand six hundred twenty-eight U.S. dollars. Its volume in the 24-hour period is 188,535 U.S. dollars. Its circulating supply is 454,636,709 DAV. Its total supply is 1,380,226,938 DAV. Okay, so you can get this um, token at these exchanges. So these are BitForex, LA Token, BitBTC, Bilax, C, and Dynex. So you can also follow their Twitter account um, named at Twitter at, at Dav Network rather. Okay, so this is Dav Coin at the Coin Market Cap. So let's proceed to their website. So that let's explore further what is Dav Coin. Okay, so you can access it here or you can type directly Dav Network. Okay, so let's go to the top. So DAV means Decentralized Autonomous Vehicles and it is the coin of transportation. Blockchain based transportation protocol enabling a decentralized peer-to-peer -peer global transportation network. Okay, so they are building a decentralized infrastructure to revolutionize the transportation industry on the blockchain. So there are two videos here. So the first video is the DAV overview. The second video is First Australian company to utilize DAV protocol for shipping and logistics. Okay, so this is the first video. So what is DAV? You can access it at their website or you can search it in YouTube. Okay. So let's DAV. So this is DAV, right? So DAV's protocols allows anyone to utilize transportation services or put their own manned or autonomous vehicles on the network, creating a decentralized peer-to-peer -peer transportation ecosystem. So what blockchain means to transportation today? So decentralized ride healing, convenient city transportation, and decentralized manned deliveries. And what blockchain means to transportation tomorrow? So autonomous drone deliveries, autonomous carriers, autonomous ride sharing. So as you can see, the difference. So everything is autonomous in the future. So this is brought to you by DAP, right? So DAP's blockchain enables a verifiable ledger of historical data from service providers, manned or autonomous vehicles, and users needed for insurers and third parties. So a completely decentralized system that isn't controlled by any government, bank, or company. A global payment standard between vehicles and their supporting infrastructure. A built-in smart mission contract with which enables trustless cooperation between vehicles and service providers. Okay, so their technology. So right now, um, that there are three major components on their technologies. So since DAV is a framework of open source software, open source hardware, and a free decentralized marketplace where anyone can buy and sell autonomous transportation services. So there are currently three. So the first one is decentralized discovery. So DAV allows autonomous vehicles to discover each other as well as service providers and clients around them. DAV implements decentralized node discovery using a peer-to-peer -peer protocol that's, that does not rely on a central server. Instead, those are listed in a distribution, distributed hash table which can be accessed in an extremely efficient way. Okay, so the DAV communication protocol, so that's the second one. So DAV defines 
a library of standardized communication protocols for virus transportation scenarios. This communication is divided into two groups. So the first one is on blockchain communication, which is done directly by calling smart contract contracts rather and through events submitted by those smart contracts. So the second one is off blockchain communication done peer-to-peer -peer using DAO's protocols. And the third one is trustless cooperation tools. So trustless cooperation between buyers and sellers of transportation services is achieved using a series of specialized smart contracts. So these contracts are ena enable multi-party contracts between buyers, seller, and needed between arbitrator, insurer, and others. These contracts are tied indirectly to the DAO token guaranteeing financial resolution for transactions between multiple parties without requiring any pre-established trust. So those are the three technologies under the DAO protocol. So okay, so let's check what um, we've built so far. So these are the community built, built modules. So let's check them one by one. So the first one is drone charging network. So drone connects. DAV connects drones and charging stations on an open network where they can buy and sell charging services using DAV tokens. So the current status is a DAV's, DAV Alliance member has made available a network of five charging stations in northern Italy. The stations offer charging services through the DAV network in exchange for DAV tokens. So this is currently offered. According to this, this is currently offered in northern Italy. And this is made possible by one of their Alliance members. Right, so that's the first one. So it's a charging network. So as you can see in the app, so you can be directed where to charge. This one matching you with charging stations. So let's proceed. So the next one is a drone drone flight planning. So DAV connects drones and service providers, allowing them to buy and sell flight planning services on the DAV network using DAV tokens. The drones pass the waypoints of the planned trip, and the route planner bids to offer a service in exchange for DAO tokens. Once a mission has been awarded, the service provider returns a list of coordinates to fly through, so that the drones can reach its destination safely. This flight plan takes into consideration environmental, topographical, and regulatory considerations. So the current status for this is integration with the DAO Alliance member has been completed and the service is currently offered in Nevada USA so right now it's currently offered in Nevada USA so as you can see if you have this app um, the drone will the drone will follow the route so that you can monitor what time will the drone arrive and where the drone is okay so that is the drone flight planning so this one is the drone missions app so the name of the app is Missions. So Missions is a first app built to showcase the DAV ecosystem. It, connect, it connects users to ship packages with autonomous drones. Users request drone services, drones bid for those services, and trustless cooperation is enabled by using the blockchain. So the current status is integration with the first drone partner, Copter Express, is underway. So as you can see, it's an app where customers or the users um, will ship package with an autonomous drone, right? So here's a sample of the app. Oh, when after it is done already, okay. Submissions, order pickup. Okay. So the next one is DAB CLI and testing. Their command line interface or CLI tool was built to make developing application services that interact with them a much more pleasant experience. It allows developers to easily run a local testnet containing DAO contracts, generate identities secured by private and public keys, and register them on the blockchain. This allows anyone to easily scaffold new projects or modify an existing one to interact with DAO and more. So the current status for this is fully functioning testnet and identity generation already used by foundation projects. So work on connecting the registration functionality with the identity smart contract is in progress. Okay. So that is DAV CLI and testnet. So the DAV developer portal is the next one. 
So their developer portal incorporates API documentation, communication protocols, and instructions for running their command line interface, local testnet, and block explorer. So the current status for this is multiple communication protocols written and a user guide for their CLI tool is now available. Alright. So the next one is a block explorer. So this allows users to explore local Ethereum testnets. So the current status is work is underway to package the block explorer, enabling it to launch automatically from the dev CLI tools. Right? So the next one is the mission control. So the current status is fully working for running simulated environments with drone deliveries currently being expanded to support the vehicles of their first partners. So the next one is my favorite, so Nemo. So this is the boat. And the current status for this is the boat is ready and it's the work on the onboard computer and its final integration in the DAV network is in progress. Right, this is also one of my favorites. So this is one is a search and rescue robot. So this one is capable of, once it's done, it's capable of locating lost drones. Right? So this is a sample of robot. Okay. So these are the community built modules under the DAO protocol. So there's a lot, right? So they have made a lot ready. Okay, so this is their roadmap plan, their white paper. You can download it here. Their team of advisors, which are from renowned companies. Okay. And their main team, CEO and founder, CTO and co-founder. And of course, since DAV is an open source project, there are open source contributors. So there's a lot of people who contributed already. And their alliance members. So there's this there's a list of their alliance members. So there's a lot already also. And if you want to become um, part of their alliance member member alliance rather. You can click the Alliance page and then register at the bottom. Okay, so here it is. So here is the form. Okay. So you can also join their Telegram group where you can ask questions there. And of course their YouTube channel. So they update this from time to time. You can subscribe also there. Right, so some facts about DAB also. Okay, so this is DAV and the website of DAV coin. So please visit this website also and keep in mind DAV coin. Include this in your research, right? So I think that's it. So before I go, I just want to say that I am not a financial advisor. Everything I see here is not a recommendation for you to buy and sell crypto. You must always do your own research before deciding for yourself, okay? So keep in mind, they have coin. So you can also visit their website. So this is their website so that you will understand what really is DAV. Okay, so there's a lot of... Um, explanation here right so that's I think that's it okay so this is Vic once again signing off